Chapter 11, Sheepshanked. A few steps into the corridor, and I discovered that my initial courage had all the substance of carnival candy, dissolving in the precise moment it was to deliver its promise. Even just those few strides in, the deep compression of the place activated a negative sense memory of my being buried alive. The jungle density hanging from the low ceiling was like navigating a gauntlet of monkey paws, each swatting at my face as I pressed forward, slicking me with their moisture. The dread in me rose persistently with each step that I took into the depth, and while I knew the tightening around me was simply an illusion, it was real enough to trigger the onset of a modest hyperventilation. Had it not been for the troth of that pulsing flower in the distance, I know that my claustrophobia would have trumped all, and I would have made hasty retreat. I cry for the creatures who can left behind But everything will change in the blink of an eye And if you wish to survive, you will find the guide inside